Hello everyone, my name is Mark Edward Blanton with The Real South Africa. And I am Dr. Latasha Blanton, also with The Real South Africa. We have an amazing group trip that you will be interested in. It's with the African Diaspora News Channel, a great YouTube channel gives you great information about what's going on in Africa. But we have a group trip featuring Phil Scott, the host. And the trip is going to take place on March 16th to the 25th. It's going to go to Johannesburg and Cape Town, and yes. it's in 2022. If you're interested in traveling, please send an email to info at therealsouthafrica.com. And we'll see you here in sunny South Africa. Hello fam, welcome back to the African Diaspora News Channel. I am Ongil Zalalem bringing you this report. Today's report is about a Zimbabwean inventor that developed a cordless television. iGambia reports a popular Zimbabwean innovator Maxwell has taken a few steps into the future of technology as he builds cordless television. The innovation has been seen as inclusive as it ropes into the needs of rural folks without access to main electricity grid. It is now possible for many people to enjoy watching TV while they are off grid. Goodbye to electric wired home appliances. Welcome to the future with the world's first free energy powered TV. The dawn of wireless self powered gadgets is here. And then in the article, it goes on um, to explain how Maxwell was able to do that. And I thought this was incredible. And uh, this is a Zimbabwe and this is an African brother that is doing this. And this is not his first invention, by the way. He is also known for innovations such as helicopter, electric cars, green power generating machines and drones that are now in use in South Africa. So this guy, this guy has, you know, the brain to uh, accomplish what he pleases. And that's just so wonderful. And we've always said this before. We need people coming out of um, Africa, the black community, so that like we stop depending on them for everything, for medicine, for, you know, our businesses, for technology. When we have our own, we don't need to accept what they tell us. We don't need to take things from them. And we just, you know, follow what our mentors, our inventors, our scientists, our doctors tell us. And we can feel more comfortable knowing that they have the best interest for us and that's a big thing knowing that it's your brother knowing that he will not on purpose sterilize you we've talked about this before remember we we talked about it from in south africa we talked about it in israel black people are getting sterilized against their will why is that because the doctors they are going to are not their race and for some unknown reason they believe in this um idea that the more we populate the more we fill the earth the bad it is for them and for some reason they keep doing that so to have our own innovators inventors scientists economists and doctors will help us battle that counter that uh is like that weapon that is formed against us so i love this all i can say is well done brother and continue doing what you're doing and you know supporting your people because even in this he's looking forward to helping people in the rural areas because they're off the grid this will help them they don't need cables they can just access the tv just like that what a wonderful genius he is anyways guys let us know down below what your thoughts are about this i am Ongil Zalalem. i'll see you on the next one bye before you go we are having a fundraiser for the african diaspora news channel we are raising money for producing more content and to help us bring the news to you that the mainstream media just refused to do so Colonization never ended in the white supremacist system. And as we see today, the colonization is in the mind. Now, those who have been enslaved and those who have been colonized, we're still dealing with the remnants of that through the colonization of the mind. Pick up my book, Seven Steps to Decolonize the Mind, and we will help deprogram you from the colonization that was put upon you by generations and generations of white supremacy. You can pick it up today on Amazon.com.